Oh. Hi there, YouTubers. Pat Prepper here. And Bear Prepper here. Well, Pat, it's here. Time to make your videos public. I can't wait. I can't either. I'm so excited to start seeing the videos coming in, and I've had a whole bunch of replies saying that they're make, people are making them, so we're going to have some entries, and I can't wait. Oh, I know. I learned so much from everybody last year, and that is the whole reason we do this is because we all learn so much from everyone, and we're so excited that you're all interested in participating, and you know, the prizes are just a little bonus. So, Pip. What are the prizes? Let's go on and go through those for everybody because we figured it out, didn't we? Yeah, and how much in value is are the prizes this year? Oh, I forgot. We have raised $1,900 value in prizes and cash. Isn't that exciting? Yay. 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 So, so can I start going through the list? Yes. Why don't you go ahead and start with first, first prize? Okay, so first prize, prize is a solar power system, $700 value, and a colloidal silver setup. That is very exciting. And, you know, remember, they can choose components from Amazon. They don't have to accept what we've picked out for them. So the second right. prize is global sun oven and $200 and a colloidal silver setup. Yay. And third prize is, um, I wish I could win this one, um, the doTERRA Family Physician Pack, and that's um, essential oils for anybody that doesn't know what that is. And I have really started using a lot of oils lately in my life, and they're amazing. So that's a really cool prize. And then also the Wonder Box, and that's also an awesome prize, $100 cash and a colloidal silver setup. Nice prize. I like that one, too. I like them all so far. I wish I was I do too. <laughs> I know, me, too. And the fourth prize is going to be the four-book collection of Prepper Books, $100, and Collodial Silver Setup. I kind of see a little ring. Oh, you know what we forgot? There's also a Cindy's <sighs> Lifestyle Treasures Sprouting and Dehydrating Book, for each of the winners. Right. Right. So, um, and then fifth place, place is a broomerang all the way from Australia. Two books from Cindy's Lifestyle Treasures and um, $25 and a colloidal silver setup. So the, the second book um, is, they're two different separate books from Cindy's Lifestyle Treasures. So yeah, that's another nice sprouting, prize. Sprouting and dehydrating. The other one is utterly delicious. So they get the extra yep. book on that one. And the boomerang. Oh, my goodness. That came straight from Australia. So that's pretty cool. That's beautiful. It's a nice one, too. It's a ring if you haven't seen it. And then the sixth prize is a Clodio Silver Setup, Cindy's Lifestyle Treasures Sprouting and Dehydrating Book, and $25. So we have six Yay. prizes this year. So six winners. Yay. So, Pat, how are we going to determine the winners this year? Again, we're going to do random.org um, for the drawing. And we've had, well, we've only had one one person say that they didn't like that idea, that they think that we should have done um, done it by vote. And I just don't think that's fair because some of the people are brand new on YouTube. And who's going to vote for them if they don't know them? They're going to vote for the more popular channels, and that just right. would not be fair. And so this is the fairest way that we have come up with that, you know. Yeah, and I don't want to choose the winner. Who, who I think did a better video because somebody who did a video right. that um, may have only put a couple little things in it or someone else did one thing and they learned so much from that one thing on the video. Who am I to decide who is more deserving? So randomizer right. gives everybody an equal chance of winning. There's no, right. you know, preference. You know, it's not like we're going out there and saying, oh, let's give the prize to this person. So I'm thinking and how most would people we like have that. We would not have been able to determine who had the best video last year because they were all great. They were all great. 
I know so I learned I think random.org is the best way to the best way to do it, you know. I agree. So. so that's what we're doing and that's what we'll always do <laughs> because we think it's what's fair. And yep. we think it honors our contestants more than any other way. Okay, so how do people enter this challenge? Um, you pick a weekend or during the week and you take 48 hours and you have to live off grid, meaning the two rules are no city water and no city electricity. And if we see that in your video, you will be disqualified. So, um, now we want you to take videos throughout this and show how you cook, show how you do laundry, you know, go to the bath. I mean, not exactly showing how you go to the bathroom, but you know, the facility no set up or no whatever. Bathroom. You can you can show the showery and that would be okay, you know. Okay. I don't care. But um so anyways, take video, try to edit it down to less than an hour, you know, so people will have time to watch all of the videos. And then you can you can post it public and you send it to Bear or I through a PM, a link to your video so that we can put it under our favorites. And you are you are eligible to win one of these great prizes. So it's 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 a lot harder than people think. Yes. And if I can give anybody hints or whatever, make sure you have enough water and keep track of the water that you went through because it'll be really interesting at the end of your 48 hours to find out how much water you really went through. Oh, so definitely. do you want to explain how to send a PM? If you go to either one of our channels and go to about, there is a place there that you can send us a PM. Just copy and paste the link to your video, and you can get that from the address bar. When you publish, it'll give you that link. And send that to Pet Prepper and Bear Prepper. Now, when you go about and it sends, it'll say Bear Prepper, you can just add Pet Prepper to that. So you don't have to send two to separate PMs. You can send them both through the same one. And Pet Prepper is all one word, and Bear Prepper is all one word. So it makes it pretty easy to do. And then we'll add it to our favorites so that we know you're entered. If in three or four days you don't see your name under our favorites, that means we did not see it. So make sure you yeah, so don't send us check a reminder us. or yeah, I'll be checking every day. I'm gonna be up early in the morning just to check and see who's sent videos. And I hope we get a, a bunch of entries. Yeah, I'll be a little slow, so give me four three or four days. <laughs> All right. So good luck, everybody. And I hope this is a great turnout. And I hope everybody learns a lot, just like last year. Amen to that. And blessings, everyone. Bye. Hello, it's the token here, and I'm pissed off. Somebody has taken my peaches. I can heat this up in the microwave for a minute or two and have me heating pad and it's flexible. Total of about 12 hours. Did not leave me anything but these little unripe ones in the back. It's a peach peril. Hello YouTubers, this is JCCL Prepper here. Today I'm demonstrating how to bake bread in the Wonder Box, which is pretty amazing. So the next step is to gently tempt each can with aluminum foil. This is my cucumber and bean trellis, and as you notice, I have some chicken wire tunnels over them. We finally managed to attract birds here. We've only been here since December of last year. I was going to serve that with a side of pasta salad, but the size of that burger, I don't think he's getting through it. Anyhow, time for a taste test, and I'm going to taste the little mini burger I've got over here.
It's been about six hours, and then when I took the temperature of it, as soon as I removed the lid, it was about 160, so I was still going to heat it up. Even I've got my uh, Block 26 here, and that's uh, fully loaded, ready to go, one in the, one in the chamber. That's, that's my EDC everyday carry. Here, hold that. Pit bull attack. <laughs> <laughs> I just attacked a pit bull. Oh, you love oh, me. He's smiling at you. You love me. <laughs> oh, Smells like Fritos. <laughs> Hey guys, I want to talk to you today about Life Straw. This is a super cool product that actually I was turned on to by Fat Backpacker. He and I were having coffee one night and he was telling me about Life Straw and I'd never heard of him. Time to expand the chicken coop. That looks a whole lot better. But if anybody hangs around with you long enough, they're sure to end up with a green thumb. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right, guys, as always. I hope it helps. Y'all take care. Lord willing. We'll see you next time. <laughs>
You gonna it's check fisted. a beer can at her? I'm too fisted. And again, nothing near me. They're all at you. Oh, <laughs> right. oh yes. <laughs> what are you doing, Pat? I'm getting another beer. What the? Because that's her favorite thing, is when people throw beer cans on the ground Here, get to it. retreat. Get it. You know how I feel about that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I'm making beef stew for dinner tonight. So what did you get bit by? Dung beetle. So now I can really, truly say that you are so full of crap. <laughs> <laughs> it's drier than a popcorn fart here. None of us have any floss. Bad preppers. The only thing at Bear's Retreat that she doesn't have is floss. I need floss. So what do I have here? I have a piece of Bear's hair. She just washed it. In an SHTF situation, if you get something stuck in your teeth. Okay, when you're making pizza or something, or bread or anything, anything that you're going to have bread with, you always want to bulk up on it because you want to get their tummies full. But you want to use as little food as possible. Is that you need to, you need to really plan your steps and your moves that you make. Get as much done as you can, while, and then take a break and sit down, work hard, rest hard, and while you're sitting there, plan your next moves because the le the least amount of steps that you have to take, the more energy you're gonna save. Hot deer snorting at you all night long. Oh, like surrounded. We were surrounded and they're like <laughs> <laughs> they were mad all night and all morning. If we were entering this as contestants, we would totally be DQ'd. Why? Because we had a hand crank radio with we music. Everybody's videos just go search prepping unplug challenge and you can you can see all the VRs that have been posted. Anyhow, I love you YouTubers, I love this woman, and holy crap.